Hello everyone, it's Italian time. Today we're going to talk about a very important topic. Probably this topic is very confusing to English speakers because we're going to talk about the difference between buono, bello, bravo and bene. I know, if you're studying Italian, I know you know these four B words. Bello, buono, bravo, bene. Let's start with the main distinction. Bello, buono, bravo and bene. You could translate bello, buono and bravo with good somehow. Then we will see the distinction. But you would translate bene with well. Bene is an adverb, it's not an adjective. So you can say, just like English, you can say I cook well. You don't say I cook good. I mean, you could, but you know that the rules, you know, rules. I cook well, cucino bene. I can sing well. So cantare bene or how are you? Come stai? Bene, well. Of course, almost everybody says good in English, but you know it's actually well. So how are you? Well, bene. Sto bene. So you're modifying the verb. Okay, bene, done. Now we have the three ways of saying good. Bello, buono, bravo. Let's start with bravo. We use bravo when we talk about a skill. A skill. Like, ah, oh, he's good. We're talking about singing and I'm not saying like he sings well. I'm saying, oh, he's good at singing. I can say, è bravo, è bravo. He's good. He's good at driving. I can say, è bravo a guidare. È bravo a guidare. It's different if I say he drives well. Lui guida bene. He's good at driving. È bravo a guidare. So it's a skill. Now, buono. Hmm. Buono and... Bello, a little more complicated. You know how Italians love beauty and art? So a lot of times to say good, we say bello. So there are some times where bello and buono both go well, but let's see, we would use buono with senses, like with the taste or with the smell. Like, mmm, che buono odore, what a good smell. Or, mmm, questa pizza è buonissima. This pizza is really good. It's taste or smell. Or um, when we talk about quality, like questa è una buona felpa. This is a good sweater. Or I have a good car. Ho una buona macchina. Also like he's a good man. È un buon uomo. He's a good man. È un buon uomo. When we use bello, we're referring to the aesthetics more, like the looks a little bit more. It's almost like saying nice. With a movie, you could say both. È un buon film o è un bel film. Both are fine. It was a nice trip. È stato un bel viaggio. So, bello is more like nice. So, let's try. How would I say, she's really good at cooking. She's really good at cooking. È molto brava a cucinare. È molto brava a cucinare. And how would I say, she cooks really well. Cucina molto bene. Cucina molto bene. Come si dice? I want to give him a good phone as a present. Voglio dargli un buon cellulare. Voglio dargli un buon cellulare. It's the quality. Buono. Guys, I hope this short video was also very useful. I think it is because I understand why it can be so confusing. And guys, check out our Patreon page because we've started a new Scuola d'Italiano, Italian school. So every week we give a real lesson, every Sunday. And it's 10 bucks a month. If you really want to study Italian, give it a shot. But even if you don't want to, thank you so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you so much. I'll see you next time.